I've got our Excalibur card out for another ride. Still got it set up with the, let's see here, 60 volt, 3000 watt mo brushless motor and five 12 volt, 15 amp hour Mighty Max SLA batteries. Currently the battery pack is showing 64.3 volts and I've got our GPS on here. Let's see if we can get a speed reading with our 60 volt setup. Got here out on the road. 62.9 volts in the battery pack. Zero on the odometer. I would say that's low. Let me slip, flip it up to medium. Got her in medium. Alright, I think that was medium. Alrighty, our battery pack is showing 63.2 volts. Got her switched up in high gear now. And we'll see what we're doing. Alrighty, 62.7. Let's try that again. 60 volts, high gear. Bing!
Yeah, it was a fun little run. Just a little zipping around real quick. She was still right along. Well, we put a, quite a few miles on her this season. Got a little bit of wear marks left on the rear tires. The front tires, I completely rounded off the one side. You can still see a little bit there. But this was the inside. I flipped it around to try to even out the wear. But everything's held up pretty good, other than the one spindle we broke. But that's all back in business and no problems. So, all in all, she's been. Kicking ass. They'll probably put the batteries on the shelf and put her away for the season. And next year we'll get her out and play some more. So far I only went with the one 60 volt motor. Put a battery in place where the second motor went. So I'd have to do some creativeness to replace, reposition the battery somewhere to be able to put our second 60 volt motor on here. But also, we had quite a bit of a voltage sag just powering this motor with these little SLA batteries. So well, I think they'd be taxing them pretty hard to try to power two 60 volt 3000 watt motors. But I'll think about it over the winter and we'll do something again next year.